bum ba dum bum. Oh, guys, I restarted my uh, computer, so I have to check the camera. Hold on. requires me to manually reset up the camera. There we go. So give it a minute. <clears throat> good morning, good morning, good morning. Headset back. There we go. Ba -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Bum 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 bum. Good morning. Hey, Harvey, how are you? <laughs> Man, I'm great. You made it. Awesome. I'm just waiting for my camera to sync up so it'll actually show. This morning we're playing Slime Rancher. I did some grinding. So we're ready to unlock the prismatic door and we're ready to um, complete the little mini quest for Ogden's Ranch. I think we're going to do Ogden's Ranch first. Hopefully the camera works and doesn't... Oh, here we go, here we go. That's interesting. Why is it black? There we go. All right. Ba -da -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. We got about eight minutes before we actually start, guys. Bum, 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 bum. So, Harvey, what have you been up to? And is the music too loud? Because when I look at it, the music and my voice look the same, and then I don't know if you guys can actually hear me. Slime Rancher. Slime Rancher is a awesomely adorable, super fun adventure farming game. So the idea is that um, it's, I don't know, centuries in the future. You decide you want to open up your own ranch. You go to the planet called Far Far Range, where you are assigned an area of land, and you have to um, run a ranch of slimes that produce plorts, which you can sell and or convert into useful items for your farm. And it's really, really cool. I, I have my mints today. I have water today. I had Doritos for breakfast like an idiot. But hey, next week... On Saturday, you guys will get to see me eat an Amish donut. I'm going to show you guys these things. Because I don't think I actually showed them on the stream. I just told you guys about them last year when Boo found them. They're like this big. They're crazy big. And they are delicious. And you can freeze them and thaw them. And for whatever reason, they don't go to crap like donuts. From like Dunkin' Donuts, which is the only other donuts I really eat, I guess. But we don't have donuts very often. But since we found those, we have them like every week because they would come out and sell them every week. Let's go over to the game screen. That way you guys can see it. There it is. This is the, the menu. Good morning, C4. How are you, sir? Rumor has it, Mochi Miles hasn't spoken to her father in years. Mochi Miles is the stuck-up and titled prick character in the game. But Ogden, he was... He used to be a capitalist. And he quit... Well, he got fired for trying to take down the company from inside. Uh, <laughs> oh, we're already full. 
so here's some of my slimes. These are pink Largo slimes. Up in the corner tells you they eat everything. If you mix it with the pink, it'll eat everything. It makes them easy to care for. Every time they eat, they produce a plurk. Ooh, we got a treasure cracker mark two. We're gonna have to go buy that. We only have 2,000 now. I'm guessing it's really expensive. So, this is our refinery where we can deposit ports that we can make use of. Or we could take them to the market and sell them there. And the Gordo Snare does work, but it didn't give me a key. And then we have all these teleport things we can make. Have some decorations, which are super cool. And no curios yet. I don't know what that's all about. Maxi77733, how are you? Good morning. I'm just waiting for 8.30 to trip before we actually go out and do the thing. We have two things I set up. I'll, get, I'll show you guys real quick. Here's some of the other ones, uh, RV, since you weren't familiar with the game. Uh, in here I have Hunter Largos. Hunters can cloak themselves. They look really hungry. But oh, they're out of food. Let me get them some food. I mixed almost everything with pinks. Uh, the hunters themselves normally eat meat, and the meat takes a lot longer and a lot more work to maintain. So if you mix them with pink, you don't get the double plorts like you can from, say, a plain hunter slime. But it is a lot easier to care for them. Alright, let's uh, actually, let's just, just shoot some straight in there. And we'll put some in here. This is an auto feeder. It's an upgrade you have to purchase. And that should have been on slow. I thought I had all of these on slow. This one's on slow too. But if you look, like all of these are full. Because there's so much other stuff going on in the game. Not so good. I'm sorry to hear it, man. I hope you feel better soon. And somewhere I must have Qberry dudes. There they are. And you're almost out. So we're going to throw them all in there. Those ones are tabbies. These ones are rocks. These ones are honey. And they look completely different. They, they all look big and pink because I made them that way. But usually the hunters are dark brown um, striped one that's very small. The honeys are golden, literally look like dripping honey. The rocks are blue like this. And the tabbies are white and gray. Like that. Um, there's the hunter colors and the honey slimes kind of look like that uh, something else we need i am probably have to have my tonsils out Ugh. illness is not fun okay so these ones these are crystal slimes I got those while we were away guys I got these off stream they're super cute they're kind of like rock slimes except for every time um, rock slimes and boom slimes combined <laughs> and every time they do their little explodey thing, they leave crystals behind. But they're purple and blue, so they're probably my favorite. These ones, again, they're pink, but they're actually rad slimes. Radioactive, and they're normally that green color there. But what we need today is a phosphor plort. These little things here, these are plorts. We have two phosphor plorts. That's going to help us unlock the prismatic door. And I'm gonna run over there and show you guys. I wanna see how much that cracker is. 9,000. Hmm. We're definitely gonna have to get that cracker. I don't know which one it opens though. So the first one we got open level, uh, open the green ones. Um, and so I don't know what color we can unlock with the two. Oh, it's nighttime. We actually have to deal with these guys. Leave me alone. I have my own sound effects. <laughs> Alright, so that's 8.30. So we can actually start. I'm going to... 
We're gonna go open the prismatic door. No, we're not. No, we're not. No, we're not. We're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna go. I want to do Ogden's Ranch first. I think it's gonna be way cooler. But the prismatic door looks like um, a Stargate, almost. Now, for Ogden's Ranch, when we first did it, we collected some uh, some of this fruit he loves, the uh, Kukadoba fruit, and he gave us a special soil. If you look at the ground, it glows blue specks. It helps prevent the, the fruit from rotting. You have to leave it there for two or three days for it to rot. The second time, he gave us these little bulbous things on the side, these half circles. Um, I think it's called the ultimate upgrade so that each little um, garden produces more food. And this is his ranch. So his house is here, but we can't really do anything. Oh wait, can we change the color? <gasps> can we could change his color? That's so wrong. We shouldn't be able to change the color of his house. We did it with ours, but... Okay, so I don't want it to be the same. Oh, he, he's got everything. What's Vanguard look like? Ogden Tech, we're gonna make all Vanguard. Oh, that looks nice. I like it. But we're blocked off from the rest of his ranch. Here, it's 10.30 p.m. There, it's 8.30 a.m. How many hours apart are we? Five. UTC minus five hours? No. No. Fourteen. Actually, it depends which way you go. Anyway, so we only need six more, which is super easy to get, which is why I didn't finish it while you're up. So the first time we got the soil upgrade, the second time we got the ultimate upgrade for the garden, and this time, he's going to give us his ranch. So I went through it. It took me about three trips, I think, to get up to 144. Is that one active? That one is not active. So all we have to do is find enough of these right here, and we only need six. And there's three. Is there a ball down there? Whoa, hello, crazy rad slime. So I need to find six of the fruit and the portal. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The portal over here usually works. Let me let me see if it's activated. It is. Okay, so we can take that portal right there. And that'll get us out of here. Is there one of those ball things in here? No. There are also balls. Can't see my face. Bam, how's that? Awesome, it's working. Thanks for the heads up, Harvey. I appreciate it a lot. Uh, he came after me. Refill faster. Push. Get up on the ledge. No. All right, we'll go out this way then. It'll be really easy. We only need one more. And that's why I uh, did it the way I did. Oh, and here, this whole place, all of these Largos are some sort of slime mixed with... I see you. I got the floor. All right, back we go. Mixed with... Oh, those are tar slimes. They're bad. Uh, mixed with saber slimes, which were believed to be extinct. Oh, and I didn't turn down the music. I'm sorry, guys. It's hard to hear the game, I know. There we go. So now you guys will be able to hear the game. Up the ramp. And we're just going to go over to that portal I found that was active. Which is cool that it was active, because they sa he said it wasn't all. they weren't always active. It was glitchy, sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't. That kind of stuff. Let's go buy a ranch. And you put it in here, and so for every three that we deposit, we also get one spicy tofu. Which basically is like unlimited ports if you have a hungry guy. Yay! Alright, let's talk to him. Oh my, oh dear. That's so many kukadobas. I can't... I can taste it now. Hearty kukadoba and parsnip pie. Sweet kukadoba. Kukadoba. Jam for years. 
Okadoba omelets with paint with painted ha C4 is a great thank you so much when you're part of the team everything is awesome when you're hosting my stream good morning C4 you're absolutely awesome thank you so much for the host sir you've given me such a gift here Beatrix I am so grateful oh yeah by the way our name is Beatrix Ogden's retreat is now yours as to use as you see fit but you know, if you wanted to keep exploring the wilds and giving me coca dobas, I'd be happy to pay you in Tokyo. So thanks again, Beatrix. It was great working with you and getting a chance to talk to someone. Oh, he's sad again. Life on the range is wonderful, but it it can't it, but it can get a little lonely out here when it's just you and the memories you can't let go. So it's good to have someone who's there for you, even if they just listen every now and again. Thanks for listening, Beatrix. Now let's get back to work. We have a new ranch. Look, there's crates of... I don't know what that is. I thought it was his tofu. Oh, maybe it's like rotten tofu. <laughs> okay, so we can't go in the building. That kind of stinks. Gotta go for a few. I need to get my battery up. No problem, Harvey. Thanks for hanging out, man. All right, so we have four plots here that we can put corrals or gardens on. One up here. Some crazy circles. All right, another one over here. What? Oh, this is the toy thing. Okay. All right, so that's just a cool building. Ah. That stinks. There was something weird back here. Yeah, that's um, like a cactus with a slime face on it. This place is pretty though, and the trees in the glass tubes. That's it's just funny. All right, so what? Uh, so it's it's basically it's just a, a big farm extension like the grotto, or uh, overgrowth, and and that's okay. Oh look, these are the things we were talking about. So either get stuff or a new... Oh, nope, nope, nope. Honey, lava dust, uh, crazy diamond, and the other thing. Alright, so I don't care about tofu. I have plenty of crystal plorts. And I have my saber plorts. So let's pick up uh, that stuff. Oop. That stuff. Where did the rest of the honeycomb go? Oh, there it is, by the tree. Actually, I could probably... There we go. Hopefully that are starting to go up. I think it's version 2. What are we talking about? Oh! Oh, 50-50 again. Dude, that'd be awesome. We could play that. So we could still go out into the crazy, crazy, dangerous world. Oh boy, it brought us here. Um, and get, uh, more of the Kukadoba fruit, but I, we can't really use it unless, ooh, okay, I want to try something. I don't, I can always get more phosphorus, uh, floor. I want to see if we can find one of the fruit. There's one. I want to see if we can plant them on Ogden's farm. I doubt it, we can, but I want to try it anyway. Into the cave. This one always seems to work. We already got... Oh, no. Okay. Not there. Wooshy, wooshy, wooshy. <laughs> Where's the one I wanted to use? Maybe it just looked different in the dark. That's probably the case. Oh, I wonder if we can get different stuff by putting the machines here. So we have the uh, drills, the pumps, and the apiaries. We might be able to get different items from his ranch. Alright, I want to try a garden. And I want to try and put the... Nope, still doesn't work. Punk. That'll rot eventually. Oh, uh, 
What day of the week is it? It is Friday morning where I am. All right, so back to our farm. So that's Ogden's Ranch. That's pretty cool. I like it. It is just another expansion, but it would let us do even more slimes and things like that. Um, will we? I don't know. But one of the things we have, uh, the opportunity to create, are teleportals. And I haven't made any of them yet. And I'm highly considering putting out... Uh, a teleporter network behind the house here. There's this flat open space that overlooks the ocean. And I was thinking we could put like all the teleportals here to go to different locations. But since I haven't unlocked all the map, I haven't wanted to put up the locations yet. Alright, so let's pop that in there. Strange diamond and the lava dust. So the slime stage, slime ball hoops are the only things we've unlocked that we haven't used. I could get some more mini, but first I'm going to go unlock that prismatic door. I got it all set up for you guys. I We have to put one port in one statue and it's going to open up. I can't believe it took me so long to figure out how that worked. I'm so annoyed. So there was a port out here because these little buggers got out. It happens every time I load in the save game. It seems that the slimes when the games first load are always super active and the air nets are not actually turned on when that happens so they get out every time because I have so many in there but that's okay only a couple of them get out eventually I might go through the effort to say you know what we're not gonna let them get out anymore but right now I don't care um, I know a game called Far From Noise and it's $7.99 on Steam or about $4.99 there. What are you guys talking about there? Woo woo for the loot! We got looted already. Ogden performs! <laughs> Thank you so much, C4. Alright, so this isn't sucking up anymore. The phosphorus slimes that we put in here were at uh, Silly Suggestion. We don't get much for them, and you get less the more and more you sell. But, I have, you know, like, 60 or 70 in there. So, we can sell large, large quantities of their plorts to make money uh, reasonably quickly. We make more money when we sell all the plorts that we have. Image hit 5k a couple of nights ago. I know, I was there. It was awesome. Super stoked for Image. You guys should go check out Image. Image plays if you're not familiar with it. She streams on Mixer exclusively for the most part. I think she used to stream on Twitch, but she came over to Mixer entirely. But she's running Terra. Her and um, Topic are running a guild on the Xbox version of Terra. If you guys want to join, you can always apply. Uh, we're going to be playing Terra this afternoon. I was going to do some grinding, but I didn't. I, I did very, very little. And I still need some input, guys. I got no responses on how you guys want me... Oh, crap. I need one of those phosphor plorts. That's a problem. Oh, hey, look. There's one. Bloop. Um, do we create a new Reaper to go through the story? Do we just continue with our Mystic so C4 and I can play together? Because right now with my Reaper, I am level 58 or 59, and I can... I still have not reached a place in the story where I can just up and leave where I am. So what happened when C4 and I were playing last, we just finished saving, um, I think it's Papu or Popa Elenu. Um, it's a Paporial, uh, Paporian town, or a town in Paporian, and... Elenu is where the Ellen race, the people I play, the little cutesy half animal, half cuddly creature, half human girl kind of thing, uh, it's where they come from. And we just finished, you know, driving back everyone. 
So the story progresses for the Reaper from that point. After the invasion of the Argons into Vaporeon, the princesses decided that they were going to turn um, Elenu into Papu Elenu, this, the town, into a weapons factory. It becomes a huge munitions factory. And it's really cool, except the Argon show up again and they blow it up like they did in the Lord of the Rings with, you know, the, the one guy with a torch kind of thing. So check it out. I figured it out at the very end of the stream. I felt stupid as, uh, as I possibly could. They even look like the slimes, guys. Why weren't you putting this stuff in the chat and letting me look like a complete moron? Look, it looks like a honey slime. It's It's got the honeycomb thing on it and it's golden colored, right? Then there's one over here. This one, okay, fine. It's just got some green sludge on it and green, so that one's a rad slime. I was trying to figure out which one was which. This one looks like a rock slime. This is the last one we need to. Literally, the antennas and the wings for the phosphor slimes. Every time I put in one of the plorts, it lit up one of the lights. As you can see, we have one left. And it made this little slime chorus noise. So hopefully we get to hear that again right now. Uh, but we're going to put in the last one. And it's this phosphor one right here. <laughs> that. Oh, look at it go. Is it going to open or is it just going to spin? Do I have to go up to it? Oh, is it a portal? <laughs> that was cute! Look at the little clouds and stuff. Oh, it's adorable. <laughs> uh, yes, C4. So, um, ancient ruins into the past. What are you? E to activate. <gasps> oh, cool! Ooh, there's more. I think that... Okay. Oh, that's neat. Okay, so the Reaper's backstory is... So after what you and I did C4, where we saved the place, um, and they made it into a big munitions factory, and after it got destroyed, the Argons were pushed out again, but they've used some sort of bioscience to infect the animals and the plants and the entire... The trees, everything. And Princess Alina was in, or no, I'm sorry, it was Princess Rita, was in such despair that she cried um, and went her, uh, over the lake. And when her tears hit the lake, it summoned these Ellen Reapers from the depths of the lake um, into existence, essentially. And then you're back there for completely honorable vengeance, uh, an unending vengeance. It's really cool. The little choir. I know. Well, I really wanted to play with you with my Reaper. Have you been playing much C4? Because, like, my Reaper's, like, like I said, like, 58 or 59. Ooh, there's a crystal thingy. Can I suck it up? No. It's just a light. All right. Oh, there's a little carrots growing. Oh. <gasps> This is so freaking cool! Can I suck up some of that water? Because I need water. And why is the water green? Hey, there we go. I'm getting water. I got close enough. Well, one of the cool things, and I'll, I'll show it all off this afternoon. One of the cool things about the Reaper class is that they're a mid-range combat, which I really like. Um, mid-range, highly mobile, and they do ever increasing damage. So their regular attack starts off doing like six or seven thousand damage up to about 15 or 20 per hit through the five hits that they do. Um, but if you do all the special attacks that are chained together, they start off doing like not eight or nine thousand, and the final hit, which is Sunder, does like 150,000 damage. It's really, really cool. Oh, he made it here too. What are you? Quantum slimes! I found quantum slimes! What? They're phasing out. What the hell? Whoa, where'd you go? Come here. 
No. Oh. So they can like create duplicates of themselves. What to hide? Hello. What are you? Phase lemon. I'm guaranteeing those are the favorite fruit of quantum slimes. Oh, that's so cool. You play a couple hours a day, you hit level 43. Okay. Fascinating, aren't they? Who do you think constructed these ancient ruins, and for what purpose? I'd visit this place and ponder that question often. Only one thing for is for certain. These folks like slimes. Eventually, I came to realize what this place was what this place was for and how to utilize it will you do the same oh it's got a function like a proper proper function because let me tell you how freaking cool this is i love the new places oh more quantum slimes we are taking these guys home <laughs> look at them they're like all drooly mouthed in my in my hot bar on the number one there oh it's so cool Oh, it's great. What the? Oh, chicken. Hello, giant slime. That is weird. Okay, so it looks... No, it doesn't. Okay, the sheen they give it makes it look like a rock inside a glass ball. I wonder if it is. Maybe it moves. We trigger a trap or something like an in Indiana Jones. What the heck? What? what? Oh, there's another door. Okay, well, there's a platform up here with a but. Oh, my. Okay, how many doors are there, then? Alright, there's not one over there, so there are three doors. Friday morning and Saturday morning streams are the only ones I can join. No problem, Harvey. Don't stress over it, man. I mean, I always have my videos up, okay? And you can always communicate with me in Discord, uh, through the YouTube vids, um, on Twitter... Okay, so if you got questions, you want to say something, by all means. Uh, poor little dude only got half a face now. Okay. Okay, I just had like six doors. And I'm... Okay, okay, okay. There's that. Okay, all of this is open now. What closes when I do that? Okay. So I want to try this one over here first. Just because it was near the entrance. Wow, look at all the puddle slimes! Hey, puddle dudes! Okay, so uh, I guess maybe it's because there's a waterfall here. Ooh, look at that. That's cool. Ooh. Look at it! This is so cool! <laughs> well, there's another one over there. Oh, look, it's the, the fake one and then the real one. That is so cool. What is that? Okay, there's another door. Oh, this is going to be confusing. What is this? A holographic tree? What? I saw you. Where'd you go? No. Yes, we got a gold plort, guys. That is my first ever gold plort. And I don't know how he didn't see me coming. Okay, so even the, the real quantum slimes phase out. In and out. Oh my god. Is that where we were a second ago? Did I walk up this way? Oh, there's a, a pink quantum Largo? Is it you? A quantum Largo. That's cute. Man, this place is massive. But you made me want to watch every stream. You do now. Well, I'm glad you like it. Uh, when I discovered you was actually looking for Subnautica streams. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Subnautica. I'm hoping for the DLC that, you know, people have talked about and rumored and whatnot a couple of times. But 
Until we actually find out. Who knows? There's another door. Look at all these quantum slimes. I'm sure quantum uh, ports will be really, really valuable for a while. Oh man, looks like you can get stuck. Oh, a crate. Boom. I wish it was daylight. I, I'd rather like to go around this place in the daylight, I think. Oh, that's cool. Look at the quantum tabby. Oh, it's a fake one. He got me. I bounced on that slime. Poor slime. Oh, these guys are friggin' adorable. I love this game, man. This game is just great. And it's an adventure game. But then there's the, the farm, the, the management game thing or uh, thing to it. Gold plur. Woo! <laughs> I tried updating the um thing this morning. It didn't work. What is this? What what what? Whoa, 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 uh puddle plur oh bloop. A red echo. What the heck is a red echo? Another closed door. Oh, I'm just, I am so lost already. So that door just comes through here and closes that one. Is there any significance? Did this one go elsewhere? It went up. I guess it's just a preference. Oh, what's it? What? The ghostly phase lemon trees that you may have seen here are real head scratcher for me for the longest time. I kept dreaming about ice cold glass of lemonade on the long summer days I spent exploring these ruins. Delicious stuff. But here's the trick if you want those lemons, you've got to be willing to part with a fruit of your own. Give it a shot. Oh, that's cool. So, they put this here. We can get more puddle slimes later, guys. Alright, so you take a pogo fruit and you shoot it into the phasing tree. There's one here somewhere. I saw it just a second ago. Hmm. Not down there. I thought I saw him as we were running up here. Well, I'm sure we'll find another and we can look at it. Well, hello, Phosphor Slimes. Okay, this door up here. I wonder if that's what that lever over there is, or the, that button there is for. Okay, it definitely is. It unlocks that upper section and closes the one we just came through. This is amazing. Oh, whoa, 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 for the loot! I missed it! Dang it! Who, who looted me and what did you say? I'm sorry I missed it. Gold poo woo. Slime makes me feel nice. More advanced treasure cracker. Okay. Um. Phase lemons will have to do. Wow, I have no idea where I am. What are you? Oh, it's the map reveal thing. Awesome. That'll help. Because we don't have this map revealed. So there's some super cool teleportal thing up here. There's a teleportal here back to home. My loot, this game is the plort. <laughs> Thank you so much for the loot, C4. Okay, so in this game, at the very least, there's another door there. You have to uh, find your way to the big teleportal thing at the end. Oh, this is an open door. 
Oh, okay. Wow, we're back here. Which way are we? Oh, we're facing south. We want to go north. Oh, I should be more careful with my energy. Okay, I really want to go up, so I have to figure that bit out. So the fake ones disappear when you capture the real ones, and they don't seem to jump as much. Okay, so I can't fly up there because it's just too high. Down there is water, and so I think we have to go to the right, to the, to the east. See if we can go east somehow. Yeah, over there. How do we get over there? I don't think our uh, flying abilities might be. Oh, yep, yep, we can get right there. Oh, there's one of those trees, too. You're the real dude. You're a real dude because you just popped out the ground. You're a real dude. Real dude. There's one of those hollow trees. So you have to shoot fruit into it to get fruit out of it. Which is kind of cool. I like it. Alright, so... Alright, so how far did we make it? All right, so that over there, I think is the same place though. Well, where did we get stuck? Did we get stuck here or here? I think we got stuck here. All right, so let's, let's look over here. Okay, we just walk over here, easy enough. And there's a door right there and a switch, which I presume opens this door. Okay, we can go straight across. Do I have to get higher to get up there? Oh. Hmm. Maybe we can get... Oh, we can get up on the inside. Oh, this is the original room. I'm pretty sure this is the original room we entered. Could I have just walked around? Because that would have been funny. I think that's where I'm trying to get to. Yeah, it sure is. Oh, yeah. And this was the... Uh, you had to fly across it. And the other one was just kind of a walk. It's like an actual temple. This is so awesome. This game is so much more finding things and whatnot than I'd have thought. <laughs> it's just so cool. Wait, have I already been here? What can I say except you're welcome? Again, the song in your head. No! No, I don't have a slime key! Ah! Oh! Guys, we need a slime key to unlock it. And you know... Ah! Alright, so it says right up the ramp, though, there's a teleportal. So we can at least pop back home real quick. Oh, wait, actually, it was right there in those stairs. I thought that was another tree. Oh, no, it only takes us home. We can't quick travel back there? I do have one. I thought I had one somewhere that I didn't know where it came from. Alright, so we have quantum slimes. Where would they like to live? And do they have an issue with the sun or anything like that? I guess we'll put them... Hmm. You know what, sir? I, oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay, so if you run into your, uh, it's a scare slime. <laughs> All right, one corral coming up. My walls, music box, air net. You know what? Forget it. We'll even get the solar shield, so we don't have to worry about it. All right, there we got everything for them. Quantum slimes go. Now here's the real question, okay? So I have that gold plort, right? What do they eat? 
fruit. Okay, just fruit, period. Um... Do I... Oh, man. I don't know. Okay. So, do I sell the gold plort, which is worth a lot of money, or do I put it in the refinery? Because it's the only one I've ever got. Oh, look at that. They're making all the fakes outside. That is messed up. <laughs> That's going to get me a lot. Guaranteed. We're getting lots of quantum plort. Let's see how much there were. Oh, the quantum ones sing? Or is it the music box? Okay, it's the music box that makes the singing sound. They're gonna escape, aren't they? Some of them are escape. I, I can see it coming. Alright, we're gonna put it on slow feed. The slime looks to... I know! I don't know what the heck a red echo is. I'm gonna try and refine it. Nope. There goes a the gold plort. We refined the gold plort. Um, well, we don't have any quantum plorts in here, but we can get one. I put the gold plort in the more better. Yeah. I guess. I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, the quantum plorts are funny looking. And we're going to destroy this Oka Oka. Actually, no, this is the only Oka Oka I have. And the and the the phase lemon is a fruit. Oh wait. Am I gonna have to Crap. Okay. Well these guys will eat anything because I made them pink. Do they have food? Do they need food? They don't really need food, so we're gonna put all the oka in their pen. And they'll eat it at, at their leisure. Oh, I just used my slime key. Oh, bother. Hey, I didn't have a slime key. You have to find Gordos supposedly in the wild because the one I trapped, I trapped one right here. I don't know if I did that during a stream or not. Uh, he did not give me a key. All right, so we're going to demolish, or remove the crops. I'm not going to demolish it. We're going to remove the crops. We're going to plant phase lemons. Okay, those look more solid. So I'm guessing they're just going to... What the heck? What? That was like super mega fast. I mean, they're not done, but... Alright, we're going to put some quantum plorts in here. We're going to sell some. I think I need to build a storage unit, guys, for that red echo. I don't know what it does. I have no idea. Cosmic99, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Quantum plorts are worth eh, 61. And we could spam farm them if we wanted to. We definitely... I was wrong, okay? Ogden's Ranch is cool. But we got a new follower, Cosmic99. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to E. My Alright, where can I build a storage unit? I think all of my plots are in use everywhere. I don't want to put it on Ogden's farm though and forget about it. So, you know what? We will demolish this plot and build a silo. And we'll take all these carrots and we'll go feed them to somebody. I got lots of pinks, so. Okay, all those unfortunately are gonna rot really fast, but that's okay. What? What? Do I have to, oh, I have to buy an upgrade, okay. Additional storage. Alright, so this is the max silo. Four locations, three um, sections in each. Red Echo. 
All right, we are storing our red echo. And it's cool because it lets you store multiple things. Oh, but I thought it did. Oh, no, I must be able to store three full things of red echoes. I got it. Suit up and get, yeah, for skydiving. We have lots of games on the channel, and most of them are focused around flying. You guys are all jumpers. So, I hope you're not in fear of heights or jumping out of a perfectly good airplane. It's just the channel theme. Alrighty. Who needs food? You guys are completely empty, and I know you were doing Q-berries, so we'll give you Q-berries. I think we have a lot more exploring to go do with the, uh... <laughs> okay, you know what? I just realized we opened the prismatic door, and I remember it's something somewhere saying something about prismatic slimes, and we still don't have any. So prismatic slimes must be slimes capable of combining all of the different plorts without resulting in a tar slime once you hit three different plorts. Which is cool! These guys, they're hilarious. And they only create duplicates when I'm around. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so I do want to create um, more drills, pumps, and apiaries. And at this point, I, I need at least six. Um, so I can put three at Ogden's Ranch. I want to see if we get stuff in there. Um, actually, I should also put some out in the um, wild next to Ogden's Ranch. And now in the ruins as well. So that's three. I um, On the map, do I have... I do have stuff I need to go check. Indigo. Um, oh, there's a Gordo there. What do the greens eat? What's the diet of a green? I escape Slimepedia. Slimes. We're missing one here. Wow, we're missing a lot of slimes still. Tar, Feral, Gordo, Largos. Um, so where are, we haven't actually found any rad slimes. I can't even look up what they like because we don't have any. Alright, so we'll take some fruit, we'll take some vegetables. Uh, this is almost full, fully grown, so we'll harvest it. Hopefully, one section will be enough, and it'll give us a key most likely when we uh, when we complete it. So that'd be awesome. Cosmic, they like veggies. Okay, so I only have twenty three Oka Oka. We got a mail from Casey. Um, I gave these guys carrots. Silly. Wrong button. Alright, so Indigo, this way. Thank you very much for the help, Cosmic. I appreciate it. Alright, so how... Do I get here again? I forget. I don't actually think it was up there. Let's see if I can remember how we got there. Not there. No, am I too far out now? Oh, no, okay.
Yeah, we hadn't captured any actual rad slimes because they were all like gordos and stuff. And maybe we have to come out at night and I have it. Okay, well that's cool, but... Oh, there's one, there's one, there's one. Don't eat anything! Owie. Come here, rad slimes. Hmm. Okay, so there's some angry guys in here that we have to be careful of. The feral slimes. Which, if you just feed, they calm down. You got mail. I did get mail. I did indeed. How far are you in the game? Cosmic, I'm pretty far, I feel. But you saw I'm missing quite a few of the slimes. Ah, here he is. Oh! Rad, sploop, bloop. Nope. Uh, crap, where is his little hole at? There it is. Have some carrots. Oh, shiny. <laughs> what? No, is there a lucky nearby? Wow, he took all 50. And we'd already given him some before. I'll take that, thank you. Okay, my radiation's really... Oh, because there's another guy there. Okay. My radiation is settled, thank goodness. Woo woo for the loot! Built for professional gaming! What's that say? Logitech G Pro Gaming Headset. I prefer my Astro A40s. Quantum, wantum, little guys! Wanton? No! Not allowed to make them into wantons. So I've seen a lucky, um, a lucky slime before. Apparently, we just passed one, or one showed up very close to where we were, because it popped up. Um, but this is the map we've uncovered now. All of it. We just got into the ruins. Um, we haven't gotten into this location, which I am assuming is where the the prismatic slimes might exist. But I'm guessing it has something to do with that teleport that we can't get to because we need a slime key. And we just got one. So we're headed back there. But for right now, I guess I should try and check these other ones. But we're really close to the teleportal. So it'd be a shame not to go home as soon as possible and uh, go unlock the next door because I want to. Sorry, got to go take care of my own ranch. Bye. I'll see you later, Cosmic. Hey, we, get, we unlocked a gray slime lamp. That's cool. Am I still going the right direction? Yep, I had a right port. Awesome. Poof. Alright, we have a hen. Let's, uh... He's hungry. That's our little hunter slime pet, basically. Um, the quantums don't need to be in the dark and I don't actually have, but they eat veggies. Or no, no, the quantums, I meant to say the rads. You know what I could do? I can, I can release all of the, um, rad gordos I have, and I can put the quant, the, uh, rad slimes in there. How am I going to do that? No real idea. Guess we're gonna have to launch them though. To keep ourselves from getting over radiated. So, one at a time doing that. That's what we're gonna do.
Okay, so I did it with only getting 44 that time. This game is so much fun. Forty-five. I guess if I ran, it would help, huh? Forty-five. Okay, I can deal with forty-five. Why launch them away? Uh, because I want somewhere to put the rad slimes, and I don't want to have to go to Ogden's Ranch to do it. Um, and if I don't, unfortunately, launch them into the water to be destroyed, they will stay around the ranch, and they will develop into tar slimes. Tar slimes can get in and out of corrals and kill all your guys, so... Okay, now we can put all of our little rad slimes in their pen. We'll be able to farm their uh, porch just the same as everyone else's. We just have to make sure that they have vegetables to eat instead of whatever I feel like giving them. But I have all this oka oka, so we're fine. We can even take some of these rad plorts here and sell them now. Um, they were... Pink Rad Largos, which means they produce a Pink Plort and a Rad Plort at the same time. So if we would have left them in there, the other Rads that we just brought would have turned into Pink Rad Largos as well. And while it's not necessarily a bad thing, they wouldn't have fit. And you can get a lot more uh, Plorts out of the individual types. And I've been considering doing that for a while, just getting rid of all of my Largos and putting in just the individual types. Um, it's more effective that way. The problem is, it also takes a lot more uh, focus on the farming aspect in the gardens, because they have specific diets. Make these guys a little less angry. Yeah, yep. Plus, when you get the Largos, you can get about seven in a pen. You can put more in, but they are going to bounce around so much that they start constantly breaking through the air net. So, I found that my max is between seven and nine, depending on the type. These guys, that these Foster Slimes, if you mash them with a pink um, and make Largos out of them, you will be lucky to keep five in there because they bounce and fly around so much even with everything else on, so. We need a 9,000 for the next cracker, which we're gonna work on slowly. I am more interested right now in unlocking that other door. They're like popcorn when they when you feed them. Oh yeah, they get all excited and start bouncing around all over the place. Uh, but when it comes to even the super energetic ones like these guys or the cats, if you have just that type in there, um, you're looking at putting easily... 30 or 40 of them in there and then you do what I did here you know when you need a certain port you just you spam feed them with your gun dumping in all of the uh, food and then you get hundreds of plorts really easy now for these guys they're pretty gentle even though they're energetic so we're looking at um, 
like 60 or 70 in this pen right now. And with the rad slimes, I'm guessing we could easily put 60 or 70 as well. So we'll collect more as we go. With these guys, we're, we're probably going to be limited to like 30 with them. I don't know how many guys we got in there now, but it's not going to be hundreds. Okay, and you can't put a port back in. That's interesting. I've never tried it before, and I just now realized I've never tried it before. Alright, well there's that 9,000 mark we were looking for. That's cool. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So who wants to go open an unusual door? Oh, this one. This is the one I'm looking for. This, this one's not active, and I don't know where it goes. So I'm guessing either... Well, no, because we took this teleportal, and it just brought us back. It didn't go back and forth. So I'm guessing that one must lead to this zone here, which I'm hoping we can access when we unlock whatever that blue glowy thing is. So let's go try it. Uh, where am I trying to go? I'm trying to go to... How do I get there? How do I get there? Ooh, you know what? Since I don't have a good way to get there, maybe I should craft a teleportal. I'll put one here at the house. I'll take one out there with me, and we'll put it right where the door is. That way we can, well, we'll, we'll, we'll explore a little bit first. But if we put it near the door, then we can have access <laughs> to both areas easily. Look at those guys up there. That's hilarious. Oh, I love it. These guys are great. Alright, so what do we need to make some of our warp tech? Um, let me think, let me think. We're going into the ancient ruins. So I'm going to say the gray teleportal will be for ancient ruins. We need indigonium and tabby plorts. Tabby plorts are easy. Indigonium, not so much. We need to get some drills. So I need lots of rocks and lots of pink plorts. C4 was last playing Assassin's Creed Chronicles China. Yep, it works. What? Never used what command? Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. So what did I just say? We needed pink and rock quartz. And what we're going to do is we're actually going to just create several of the advanced drills. Because I know the drills got me the indigonium. So we'll create like three and we'll put all three down in hopes that they will uh, produce what we're looking for. So let's deposit these into the refinery. There is a refinery deposit. We should build one of those because we can put it in the middle like we did the cell. Uh, we can put it right nearby. Okay, so advanced drill. Oh, we needed rad plorts. Good thing we brought all those rad plorts back. Fabricate, fabricate, fabricate. Oh, no, we need more pinks. Wait a minute, what do we need for warp technologies? Refinery link. Fabricate. I may have actually created like refinery links already. I think I might have said we had one. Okay, we're gonna turn the light off. I don't like the light. You stalking C4? Am I stalking? I don't stalk C4. Alright, so I want to put a refinery link in here somewhere. This looks good a place as any. Install. Alright, so now we can go crazy. Filling up the refinery with whatever we want. Especially the pinks because they're used in a lot of recipes. But that's good because all of our Largos here produce tons of pink plorts.
when I get a job, okay, you and me both. I'd love to get a big computer, but I'm not allowed to get one till next year. Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah, I would love to have a big computer too. Um, like I have a desktop. It's physically large, but it's aging. Some bits are literally failing. Um, I've replaced both the processor, some of the RAM that went bad, and the graphics card over the life of the computer. And it's extended it a lot. It has. But now the motherboard's failing, and it's just such a dated system, it's not worth repairing. Plus, the motherboards, the new B350s and Z399s, or X399 motherboards, now, I want to point out, X399 is not your normal motherboard, it's top-of-the-line hobbyist stuff, okay? It's enthusiast stuff, because we're not hobbyists, we're enthusiasts, um, which are hundreds and hundreds of dollars, okay? In order to find a board that would fit my dated old computer, it's actually the same price to get an old motherboard that fits the processor and equipment I currently have versus just buying a new one. Unfortunately, I don't have the money to do either. I'm trying to get a job, but I haven't got any callbacks yet. I'd love to be able to get like a second monitor and everything, but I just can't afford that stuff. Um, hopefully someday we'll get there and the stream will be that big and they'd be absolutely awesome. If that's the case, I, I'd certainly switch. We'd be doing, um, five days a week at least and they would definitely be six to eight hours of streaming. Um, uh, but it'd probably be two four hour sections like I do the two threes now. Um, and they'd each have a 15 minute break in the middle of them. I know I only needed the other ones, but I figured if I'm here doing this, I might as well get them. You have zero expectations for PC attributes. Uh, well, I have a lot of time invested in the computer. Computer, home computers were something that were completely foreign to me when I was young because of our financial situation, okay? We, we didn't have one. My parents didn't own a computer until a decade after I moved out of the house kind of thing. So. That being said. <laughs> uh, I was really interested. I would go to the library at school every chance I got. To uh, mess around with the computers. To research computers. I took every computer class I could get my hands on. Both in high school and in college. So I've done programming. I've done maintenance. Um, I signed up for a maintenance career with the military when I joined the military. That didn't work out exactly how I hoped, but I got a broader range of knowledge for fixing all electronics. You little buggers! Some of them got out. Some of them got out. All of them got out. What the heck? All of them got out. They cannot be contained. Come back, you little buggers. That one's real. Holy cow. Okay, is it also to contain quantum slimes? Because these little guys are everywhere. And I do not want them getting in like there. Oh no. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, you have got to go. There's another one? Where are you guys even getting the pink plorts? What the heck is going on? I don't understand what is going on. How did you guys get out? Where did the pink ports come from? What? You're not allowed to phase away. Poof. There was another one. I saw him. Unless that was his.
I don't know where... One of them got a pink port somehow. Oh, no. That one looks bit... Okay, no, it's just floating. Alright, these guys might be too, um, energetic for containment. I don't know. Or maybe they got out because they were hungry. They didn't have any food. I, I just, I don't know. My first computer was a desktop I found on the side of the road. We had a crappy little USB thing that worked as a modem. I can relate. Uh, my first computer that Boo and I ever owned, I think, yeah, was a crappy little laptop that, um, I bought off a friend who, it, it was a crappy little used desktop that I bought off of, uh, one of the guys I worked with in the military. You don't know Jack Hall. Instead, they're die. Oh, Pogu. You can't contain them. They just phase out. Are you kidding me? This is going to be a disaster. And. Ooh, the quantum lemons. So they just phase out of their container. I just cleaned them all up. We know they didn't just get out. The phase lemon. I wonder if I hadn't put fruit nearby, if they would have just stayed because there wouldn't have been a food source. Oh, you know what? I wonder if their phase ability literally lets them go wherever they have their phase at. Do you understand what I mean? Like, those phase um, are going out. So I wonder if they can phase here because of it. That's some crazy crap. We're not going to be able to contain them. Um, they might be a good one to put on Ogden's farm. Oh, I missed the loot. Woo woo for the loot. Thank you so much for the loot. I'm sorry I missed it. What kind of stuff did you do in the military? Oh, Harvey, I repaired all office equipment, not just computers. We did computer work, switchboards, telephones, fax machines, everything. Um, I did a lot of, of networking switchboard equipment uh, because it, <laughs> it was complicated and took a long time to complete. All right, so what was I gonna do? Oh, right, I wanted to build a warper. And then the stupid dudes quantumed on me and I got all distracted trying to catch them. They're all back out now. Screw it, I don't care. Let them be. If it becomes a problem, I'll worry about it then. Do I have enough to build that third drill? I do. So I wanted to build this gray teleporter to the ruins, but we need more indigonium. Uh, so we're going to use the extractors, um, in this case the drills that we made, in the Indigo, Indigo Valley, Indigo, what's it called? Okay, I'm at the ranch. When we go there, it'll tell us. It's Indigo something. Um, and we'll put the drills in the cave, and hopefully we'll get some Indigonium. And then we'll also go check out the other ones. I have three other, uh, extractors in the Indigo area. But they're all spread out. One of them we went to the apiary already. Um, because I was interested in knowing if we got different things from different locations. So, drill, drill, drill. Now, we definitely get different things from different zones on the map. Okay, indigo quarry is what it's called. Alright, so where are we in the quarry? We're right here, because we just put those down. Alright, so let's run out and check the other ones. I'm not sure exactly where I placed them all, because I placed them all over. When I realized I could see them on the map, I wasn't 
too terribly stressing over it because I figured it wouldn't be too hard. Oh, I put a pump over here. Why did it sound like an apiary? Oh, I didn't buy the treasure cracker. Maybe I should have. There might be one in there. Yep, there's one in here. Okay, so this was like the lava zone. And I believe I put the drill in here. Yeah, I thought they were contained earlier too. Wow. Well, that worked. We just got five. We needed like ten, right? So... We might just uh, make it simple on ourselves and lapse four or five hours kind of thing. Uh, go to bed, basically, in the game. Alright, um, the other one's down there is the pump, I think. Nice. What is it? Primordial oil. Okay, so nothing special from that. Primordial oil is the common item. And I think we already checked the apiary, but we'll run over there and see if it's done again already. It might be. It's been a whole day, I think. Should really check on... Yeah, it is done already. So the apiary is not finding anything cool here. Uh, the apiaries do best in this zone here. When I put it here, I actually got honey from it. Uh, which was really cool. Uh, where are we compared to... Teleportal? Looks like it's this way. But left? can't go around so I'm gonna have to go through the meanie zone uh, we're gonna go through here I'm gonna just owie phase back to <laughs> phase back I'm gonna teleport back um, to the other zone uh, to the ranch go to sleep wake up and go out tomorrow morning uh, we'll come back here we'll have plenty of indigonium guaranteed um, if one gives us four, I also think there's, do we have advanced drills? I think we have advanced drills, but it's possible we could get some others instead. So let, I'm going to go the whole way back here just so I can see it. C4 could not start the plane. No, man, these guys are everywhere. And the second they get a pink port from these guys, I'm screwed. Owie. So... We are going to take the plorts out so they get sucked up. I think, oh crap, I have to deposit it. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. I pulled those out and now those guys are going to eat them. Alright, so what I need to do is we're not going to feed them anymore unless we need it. We're going to feed them on a, a need to feed basis. Because when these guys explode, sometimes the plorts fly out. And if they get three different ports, then we're going to have tar slimes everywhere. Unless the quantums are capable of having all the ports and turning into prismatics. That might be. We could try it. God of War released today. Do you like any sort of mythology wings? Um, specific mythology? Not really. I um, am familiar with a lot of demon stories, I guess. Um, because I watched some shows that pertain to it, and my family heritage a lot of Scottish and Irish, and so the strong religion beliefs and uh, demons were in my family. So, like, I know the I know the stories. Deposit all of these. As, as long as the port collector will collect them all, we'll be fine. But if not, then we're getting in trouble. And I'm nervous to test it, even. I mean, I could test it. Controlled circumstances. I could just start feeding it to them manually and see what happens. Because then I can just destroy a tar slime immediately if it forms. I think we'll do that. We'll see if the quantum slimes are capable. You look like a good test subject. I don't like you being here. I'm 
Nope, he turns into a tar. So it definitely would be a bad thing if they got all the plorts. Or any of the plorts for that matter. And it looks like he's trying to phase in. So I am going to go through. I'm going to suck up all the food. And remove their food sources. And you could go back in there. Alright, I think I got it sorted. They don't have any more food, so they can't um, produce plorts. And it definitely turns into a... Uh... I'm curious about Celtic stuff. I'm of Irish and Scottish descent. Cool! You guys should totally eat that and have some fruit. Alright, um, right, I need to sleep. Okay, we need to sleep, and then we need to go collect more Indigonium, create the teleportal, so that we can have awesome teleportation capabilities. Besides, we have some email to read. New from Casey. Hi, B. Do you remember New Year's Eve when you were looking for that party? While we were wandering around the city, lost, I got my bearings and didn't tell you because I knew we were close to that coffee shop run by the tyrant. And since it was starting to rain, I thought it would be really romantic to stumble across that the place again. I guess I finally found the courage. But the coffee shop went out of business, and it was a taco place now. So we ate tacos in the rain, and it was just the best thing. We were on the roof of your old apartment hoping to see the fireworks. Uh, I was going to tell you something then, but that's when you told me about Africa. It sounded like an amazing trip. I was really happy you were doing what you love to do. I should add in mainly those two, I believe, in percent I am. Um, yeah, I don't think that, I mean, I know it matters as it goes, it, you know. You can have a lot of one thing and a little of the other, but, oops. I didn't sleep. Seven Z clubs for 20k to get Silverstorm 2. I got up to level rank 14. Silverstorm 1, guys. Alright, let's sleep till morning. Go collect some more Indiegogo. Indiegogo. Alright, two Indigo Quarry. And our drills. So we'll probably keep, and I actually put them in the indigo quarry down that bottom because I thought we'd get lava stuff out of it, or more likely get lava stuff out of it. Whether we will or not, I don't know. Wow, we only got eight indigonium. Alright, so the other one's through here. Which way was it? Through that um, tunnel, it looks like. Yep. Stop it, dude. Relax. Okay, so we didn't get as much as I'd hoped, but that's okay. We still have nine, which might still be enough. I don't remember exactly how many we needed. I thought we needed 15. I thought we only got five, but we'll see what happens. You're not wearing a kit unless you're com commando. Uh-oh, kilt. You're not wearing a kilt. I told uh, Boo last year that I wanted to... Get a proper kilt that I could wear out um, for Halloween and stuff. Which I won't be commando. 
Um, because it'd be too freaking cold. Yeah, calm your spikes, dude. Jeez. Dude, go radiate love on somebody else. And the whole not wearing underwear under a kilt is actually pretty rare. Uh, it developed because nobody wore underwear back in the time frame. You know, underwear was basically a, a long pair of light linen cloth of pants and shirt kind of thing in most areas, so. Alright, do we have enough to create this teleportal? These guys are out here just running amok. Let's see if they're destroying my guys back here. Nope, they seem to be okay. Thankfully, the uh, guys will um, produce plorts right on the spot when they eat. Because if there was any delay, then the, the phase ones could go in there. Alright, we got enough. Oh, we only need 10. Even better. Deep brine and more indigonium. Alright. Let's create a teleport. And I don't I, I kinda wanna put him back here. This place is like really plain back here. Oh, okay, we can only put two back here anyway. All right, so there is our gray teleportal. We're going to go. Do I have to go the long way? Is there a faster way to get there? Hmm. If I warp to indigo, it takes me here. Okay, no, no, we're definitely going this way. Oh, and I have three of the things over there, too. I should check them out. But we'll do it later. I want to get through the door. <laughs> so I definitely feel this one's faster. And if nothing else, I definitely know this route better. So... I recall that kilts are similar to a coat of arms for a family. Each family has certain pattern to their name. Um, the pattern and color matters a lot. Unfortunately, when I buy a kilt, it will not be my family's color. Mine will be purple and green. Um, and they're traditionally made with three colors. So I don't know what my third color might be. It might be like a gray, which I think would be kind of cool. Um, but it will not be um, my family's colors, which are uh, a red, orange, brown color. And it's hideous, and I don't like it. So I'm going to just get one that I like, which of course will be purple and green and blue, or purple, green, and gray, something like that. Okay, ultimately, that's the direction I want to go. am I doing on direction? I think I'm doing good. I need a door lock.
Oh, I wonder what's over there. This place is so cool. Alright, I am facing the wrong way, but I think I'm ultimately going the right way. Uh, no, I went backwards. Alrighty then. Oh, okay, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I think it, if you leave it in certain combination, it opens up fast paths. So that's the main door, and now we can just run in this side. And we're in there. Headed directly the, exactly the correct direction. Now, over there. That is the way I went last time. And I think this is a dead end here. But I'm, there might have been a door here to go through. Let's let's see if there's a door there to go through. What's that? I think that's a, a broken treasure thingy. Okay, we might be able to just fly over there. Yeah, okay, so this was the dead end. We couldn't get around. So I think we're going to try and fly. I don't want to open up. I can hit the button back there, which will open up that door, and we can walk all the way across. But I think I can just fly right across, so... Woo woo for the loot! Built for professional gaming. But not used by professional gamers. Have you been here yet? Cosmic, yes, yes. This was one of the things. I, I did some grinding off stream so that we could get Ogden's Ranch and so that I could unlock the door. So this is our second time. We had to go and get a key to unlock the door down here at the end. And I missed the loot. I, I, I pulled it up and everything. I'm so sorry. What did the loot say, C4? I know it was you. Oh, don't go down there. That looked dangerous. Um, oh, we got to keep going across. Okay. How about in the glass desert? Uh, no spoilers, please. I don't know if I want to go down there or if I want to open that door. I opened that door last time. I'm pretty sure that's where I want to go. Well, I'm down here now. Okay, well that stinks. Oh. Okay, here we go. We made it back to the temple. I want the little chime that they went off every time. Ooh. Wow. Okay. That's interesting. Prismatics. Uh, alright, alright. We can do this. Not prismatics, guys. I keep saying it. I don't mean prismatic. I keep meaning, say, quantum, which is actually phase. <clears throat> it's break time. Dun, dun, dun. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, can we get them here without too much fuss is a great question. I need a lot of fruit. There were some trees and stuff around here. What is this one up here, I wonder?
Okay, looks like there's a fruit tree over there. Oh, I'm I'm dead, guys. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm gonna make it. Woo! I didn't look to see. I said I need to start paying closer attention to my energy. You know what? If I well, thing is. No, come. Oh, okay, you guys are fine. By force feeding them plorts, they'll eat anything. So it makes it easier to get plorts, but I still need food for them. Oh, looky, a green one, the green one. I don't know what they do. I have no idea. It's not pros prismatic, it's mosaic. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for letting me know. Okay, so my alarm went off. It is time for a break, guys. And I will be back in 15 minutes. Okay? Uh, I'm going to take a short break. I'm going to go hang out with Boo for a few minutes. Stretch my legs. Get outside. See what the temperature's like and all that. Use the restroom. Refill my water. I will be back in 15 minutes. You guys, you guys should take a break, too.
Welcome back, guys. I turned off my cow, my camera. I didn't want to do that. Okay, back at it. Sliming up. Oh, I made it so quiet. I forgot to turn on the music. I apologize. And those don't actually seem to be bearing fruit. So what the what the heck? They're hiding in bushes. Can I go through the water? Yes. Yeah. Lucky, lucky. Another red echo. Verdant grass pad. That's cool. I don't know what the echoes are for. Welcome back yourself. Welcome back, wing. Um, actually, I didn't want you. I wanted the fruit. How many did we need? I don't remember. Did you eat? You look hungry. Eat again. Okay, you look happy. What about you? You're happy. Let's find someone else. Oh. Are you hungry? Yep. What about you guys over here? You hungry? No. What about you? Yeah, he's hungry. All right, I have six now. How many do we need, do you guys think? I didn't count to see how many were in there. Wow, okay. Heartbeats or vegetables? I'll go fruit. meat we're gonna have to collect chickens well, there were chickens all over this place oh no we got a tar some up top somewhere let's go get him <gasps> no 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 Okay, so we took care of the slimes. I almost lost my uh, super coolness. We actually want to head that way. So which ways up and over kind of thing? That way. Oh, okay. Right, right, right. We flew from here over there. All right, here we go. Whoosh. Up, up, up. Um, not that way. Up more, I think. Maybe not. Maybe just across. I think seven's got to be enough. Switch isn't here, but this door's open. We can just go around. Bullseye. Bullseye. Wolf Cub. Hi, how are you? Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the follow. How are you doing today, sir? Uh, my life. 
We're about to unlock whatever the heck this is. Thank you so much for the host board. Everything is awesome when you're hosting my stream. Okay, we're getting the tone. Cool! A swirly vortex of who knows what. Let's see what H has to say, though. The, ru the ruins used to be some kind of warp station. Used by whoever created it to connect one of the most distant corners of Far Far Rain. Be careful, Beatrix. Once you cross over, you'll be in truly untamed country. Though beautiful, the other side can be an unforgiving place. Alright, well I have some water, so that, that, that'll be ready. Alright, here we go. So I'm presuming we're going here, guys. I mean, it even matches up. So. Whoa! Smoke, fire, and mirrors. Oh, we're down there. Okay. This is cool. Butterscotch teleportal. <laughs> I like it. Whoa. Elio, please. Oh, it's desert instead of water? Wow. This is crazy looking. And like little to nothing grows. Woo woo for the loot that I just missed. Dang it. I need a better system for alerting me of the loots. I need it to show up on my screen. What is that? That one looks like a bunny. They're, oh, they're the little cactus things we saw in the other one. Can't do anything with them. Oh, I wonder if I could water some stuff. What is that? I'm kind of... Hey, chicken, come here. No? Hmm. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Hello. Dervish slimes. Okay, cool. Do you play Fortnite? I do play Fortnite sometimes. What are these things? Um, oh, which one gets, which one's, that's something I haven't seen yet. They have a, a thing on their head. Okay, so when I, nice try. That was close though. When I find the thing, I put it in there, and it'll squirt at that thing. So what's the other one need? Does it need a dervish slime plort? Because, you know, we have dervish slime, so maybe I can get the plort from them. What? Are you different? No, you're just a rock slime, aren't you? Yeah, rock slime. Owie, stop it. Owie, stop it again. I see you down there, dervish slime. You're mine now. Ha 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 ha. Mmm. Smells like booze make french fries. Okay, so it's not what I thought because there's not one on that one. Oh, hey! What popped up? What are you? Um, I don't need quantum plorts. A painted hen. Some believe it... What lies at the end of a rainbow. That's funny. I don't know. Could we do a duo? Wolf Cop, I'm not playing right now, dude. I'm playing this. This afternoon, we're playing Terra. You're more than welcome to play Terra this afternoon if you have an Xbox and you want to play with us. The Glass Desert is a fascinating place. But you need to be on guard. At any moment, a dangerous solar anomaly can occur that will cause all heck to break loose for a spell. You know it, you'll know it. you know it when you see it, and when you do, head for cover or risk burning your touches. Uh, what kind of cover? Where'd he go? Is 
Is that all heck breaking loose? Okay. Is this enough cover? Probably down here, huh? Need a rock one for that guy. Need a slime key there. Wolf Cub, chill or I'm gonna kick you out, man. But I want to keep everything I have. Okay. Where did we build storage? I don't remember. Out here. We built it out here. Okay. Hello, Echo, and Green Echo, Painted Hen, Derber Slime. Oh, can't put Derber Slimes in there. Okay. Well, that doesn't work. I don't know what to do. I need, um... Oh, I know how. Okay, okay. We got 10,000. We have more than enough. We can get to, uh. Here. We'll build a corral real quick. Stop that. Come back here. High walls, music box, air net. Fork collector, auto feeder. Oh, I accidentally bought that other stupid thing. That's okay. They eat fruit. We'll be back to deal with them another time. Wrong way. Wrong way. C4, do me a favor and time out, Wolf Cub. No, did he disappear? I used a teleporter so I could get back in time to, to see him. Okay, I need a rock port for that guy and that guy over there. Dude, you're spamming my channel after I told you to chill. You're getting timed out. The desert is a harsh place for sure, but there are little pockets like this where life is waiting to flow back into the soil and reach towards clouds. Of course, it might happen a little faster if you give it a helping hand. Use that noggin. Well, see, oh, wait, 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 are there more chickens? Yes. That way, if I come across a, um, a rock slime, I can put in. Uh, I can feed it and hopefully get some ports from. There's one there. Eden, you suck. I know. Let's see. The rock ones weren't that difficult to find. They kind of just popped up almost everywhere. Um, if or when I make another terror character, I want to start WC. I don't know what WC means.
Hey, the map thingy. Awesome. Um, you know what? No, no. Right now, I'm more concerned with um, exploration. I like the letter C. Oh, you want to start with the letter C. I gotcha. Another key location? Now, I can't find rock slimes to save my life. Hmm. Yeah, I thought maybe watering them would help. Because it's a desert. So much candy, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to Eden, how are you? down there the endless abyss it looks like yep where are those rock slimes what do you guys eat <laughs> not this time but I got some games coming guys I have plans to play a couple of games that those scare buttons are gonna be great for I'm already working on downloading some other horror noises so that you guys can truly try and scare the crap out of me I'm trying to feed you guys chickens and you eat vegetables! Bye bye chickens. I forgot they eat veggies. Uh, where were those heartbeats I found earlier? Boom 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 Uh I think they were this way. I love this song. Goosh. Yes! <laughs> you! Have some food! Uh, food you! Food you too! Oh, it's their favorite! That's cool, that means you get two. Whoa, what happened? Oh, okay, yeah, der. Is there a blue dude there? Would the blue dude like a heartbeat? Boom! And you, wow, there's lots of blue dudes here. All right, back we go into the cave, I guess, that we found, the ruins we found. Uh, let's see what happens if we can use these the same way we did in the other location. I mean, it'd be really cool if the whole function, so it definitely works like the other ones. Not th I thought there was one down here. No? Alright, let's go up. Ah, oh, there's one. No! Ah, Alright, I landed up on the upper ledge at least. Last warning, Wolf Cub, you're getting banned. Good luck, C4. Does anyone see any more of those little dudes? I got three, but I'm not sure... That was all of them. Oh! What's that do? 
Ancient water. Ancient water for 30 seconds? What can I water? Ah, oh, crap. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. So you get ancient water. And you take it to those, those things. These, these, right here. Renewal. Oh, cool! Oh! Looky, 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 looky! Mosaic slimes! Awesome! That was so cool! And there's a bunch of them, but it only lasts for 30 seconds, so... Like, I don't know if I can get to any of the other ones. Whoa! So what? It's expanding to other places. Oh, this is so cool! This is awesome! What? Oh, there's a field! They create fields where stuff can grow. Oh, okay, I get it. Including ancient water? Nope, that's regular water. Ooh. I have to say, the, the mosaic, um... Okay, okay, we're gonna... Ancient water for 30 seconds. Let's see if we can get the one that's outside. I don't think it was too far. There's another one over here. Cool! Oh, that's awesome! I'm out of time, but there might be another one I can... Actually, I think there's one up there. Is that right? There is. There's one up there. So we will walk down, let our energy recharge, and we're going to go walk... I agree with you. Loot alerts could be better. Yeah, loot alerts could be a lot better. Because I don't know it unless I see it in a restream chat. And if I miss it... I mean, sometimes the loots and the alerts are so disjointed, it's crazy. Come on, we got this. We're going to run up the ramp and get the one on top. Man, there are so many more locations than I knew about. This is so flippin' awesome. Oh, you, you are mine. A tangle slime. Keep popping them out. Where the other ones come from? I hear them popping. Okay, there's not okay there might be a sunstorm thingy a solar flare coming I'm gonna say we wait in here those are like pink plorts though All right, we have to go back to our teleporter. It is. All right, goodbye, wolf cub. C4, would you ban him, please? I know they have flowers on their heads. They're so freaking cute. So do they not affect the inside area here? I want another dervish to put in my group. Yes, you! You! Oh, no, no, no! Uh, I already have one of you. I need you. 
Is there no oh crap, the rest already left. The thing's over. Crap. So the fire slimes only come out during those solar flares. And he's way over there and he's gonna be gone when I get there. Nope, I got him, I got him, I got him. Is that was that a mosaic floor? Holy it was just really close to my face, okay. I thought it was like this ginormous Gordo or something. Oh man, this is so cool. Hello. Dervish. Okay, so I want to take these guys back, build more corrals, and then we'll come back. Dervish. Alright, where did I put them? I think I put them out on his farm. Oh, I can't carry any food with me right now. We're going to have to definitely make some food out in... Uh, Ogden Ranch. Oh, look at them. They're so cute. Okay, so I'm assuming the fires will need a solar shield, so. I'm hoping they survive okay in here. They eat ash. How the heck do we make ash? And do I get burnt? Yep, I get burnt. Owie. Oh, wait. Maybe if I just fire some food in there, they'll burn it and then eat the ash. Soria, how are you? Welcome. And I missed another loot. Ah, woo woo for the loot. One more. And we're going to put the tango slimes in it. What do you guys eat? You guys eat meat. The things that look like vegetables eat meat, guys. They're man-eating critters. And the mosaics, oh, they're so cool. We're also going to need... Oh, no, I'm out of money. All right, we're going to have to do some stuff. Uh, I don't trust to just leave them in there. So, let's go back to our ranch and sell some stuff. Earn ourselves a little bit more money. All right, um, where, actually, no, I put one here, so we could do it here. Let's see what's, um, the high value item for today, I guess, that I currently have. Oh my god, guys, we got them all! We got all of them, that's awesome! Um, those must be the little dervish dudes, I don't have any of those easily... And I don't want to do... Okay, we'll do the honeys. I don't have a lot of guys, though. Fires. Ah, screw it. We'll just sell everything. Sell it all. Um, oh, you guys look hungry. Are you guys out of food? You are out of food. I'm sorry. You guys eat everything, so have some pogo fruit. You guys are out of food. You guys are out of food. We must have been gone for a long time because those guys, I was feeding them carrots and they had over 100 carrots. Alright, so. Got some pink plorts, we'll sell them. We need money to finish that off so we can drop the mosaic slimes and go back to the other location. So awesome looking. Nope, that's the refinery. I want to sell them. We need the money this time. Wow, they're only worth five at this point, guys. Honey plorts are worth quite a bit. Hunter plorts. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. These mosaics are so freaking adorable. I don't have anything in there. There we go. Tabby plorts. Those little flower guys, tangles, 
might be my favorite. I can understand why. Alright, just to make sure we have enough money we don't get stuck doing anything else, we're going to come down here and we're going to check out our guys here. See if they've produced any viable uh, resources for us. You know what we haven't done? We haven't even looked at our saber slimes over here in a while. They're probably full. Sure are. I like the color of the green they are. And then, of course, our phosphor slimes. They, they haven't done anything, man. They're being so lazy. Thank you so much for the follow, Soria1524K. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And now, we're going to feed the phosphors. Man, I used to think it got kind of busy just you know maintaining the guys I had but I never got into the runes or past it so wow there we go get you off the tree go up top here Oh, yeah, I got these guys. Totally forgot about you, but I haven't been feeding you. So I don't have the extra Q-berry push up there. We'll just fire these in there and take what we can get. Over 100 ports. Awesome. Okay, so back we go to Ogden's Ranch. Um, there's still that teleporter there that I have no idea where it goes. Maybe it's behind one of the locked doors, which would make, like, perfect sense. I don't want these guys getting hungry. Welcome, Chaos Wolf. Grab parachutes, suit up, get ready to jump. Don't spam my channel. Or you'll get booted again. And hello and welcome. Shook it up. There we go. Give me some more. I just want to make sure our guys all have food before we leave so there's plenty of plorts when we get back when we need more money for whatever else we're going to find out there. Awesome, let's go. Actually, you know, that cracker was only 9,000. I'm more worried about the uh, getting the mosaic slimes in their place though. I didn't think we'd need it, but here we are. These guys are so cool. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I don't know. I think the mosaics might be my favorite. They're so cute. Will these guys bite me because they eat meat? No? Okay. What do you guys eat? You guys eat fruit. You all, oh, you're so hungry. Oh, and there's another empty field right there. I could have... Put them in, we didn't have to go through any of that nonsense, or did I put something in there and escape? I had lavas, and they're gone. The fires, rather. Okay, so there's got to be a special place somewhere that we can get fire slimes. Like, or I guess I could feed them during a storm. Hey, look, he's got the thing for them. 
I might be able to feed them during a storm. But if I had to guess, I'd say there's probably a location that you have to keep them. Alright, up we go. Back to the glass... What was it called again? The glass desert. This is so awesome. Alright, so I don't know where exactly we have to go. But what I am going to do is we're going to get our ancient water and we're going to run the whole way back out the front and to the left and hope that we come across another one in time to to water it i would imagine oh i'm out of energy i know i saw some Alright, so it's better to know where they are. Oh, it's here. Okay. So I need to hop up that wall. Turn at the H and hop up onto the ledge. Oop, crap. Let's try that again. Oh, they eat ash from the incinerator. That makes complete sense. So you what? You just pop them around the incinerator and that keeps them alive. Seems like we have a storm going on, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it, but we're going to give it a go. And we're going to need to stop ahead of time because we need a little energy to fly in advance. There we go. Up, up, up. Come on, up faster. Five. Okay, any crazy super special guys up here? It does not seem so. Was that all of them? I doubt it. A lot of desert here, guys. There's a lot. So, we'll have to build an incinerator, as Chaos Wolf suggested. Yeah, see, there's one here. There's no way I make it here in 30 seconds. No, because the water's here. We barely made it here. We had, I'm, we had like six seconds left. There's no way we make it the whole way back up here. So I'm thinking there, there must be another water source. And I did see... Whoa, look, there's another Gordo up there. Look at him up there. And uh, somewhere... Ah, oh, here it is. Right here, actually. Those guys. They eat meat. Tell me you're an infinite chicken producer. I don't need chickadoos. Okay, so if we go home... And we feed these hens to the... Uh, Okay, so we'll feed the hens to the tangles, and maybe we only need one? Because it's the only one I see. But I guess we'll have to put it in and, and, and see what happens. There's no place here for, like, the fountain we just experienced for the other one. Lewis Jedi Green 2, thank you so much for the follow, and welcome to Eden. How are you today? All right, let me go get the plorts. We already know we need tangle plorts. Let me go get them. Might be something with the Gordo. Might have to uh, pop the Gordo in order to get him. Who knows? I tell you what, though. I love the look of the mosaics, especially the mosaics mixed with the uh, rock slimes. They look awesome. Um, the tangles are just too freaking cute. Why did I come down here? I wanted chickens. That's why I came down here. I didn't go the wrong way. I came down for the chickens. 
All right, up through our teleporter. Easy on the emoji, Soria, or you're going to get timed out. Any tips for starters? Oh, my. Um, I would say for starting, mix everything with pinks. It makes it easy to feed them. What do you guys eat? You guys eat veggies. What's that? Oh, they just make these little shiny things. Whoa, what? That was weird. Uh, but yeah, when you're when you're first starting off, my suggestion is to, uh, oh yeah, wrong way, uh, is to mix a few of the really basic ones with uh, pinks, because it makes feeding them easy. Whatever food you can find is what you can use. Um, and I still have my starters. They're right here. Pink Rock Largos, Pink Tabby Largos, Pink Hunter Largos. I got lucky with them. I found a hunter, okay? I found two the entire game so far. Um, so I put one in there, and the other one is in his own special cage over there. And I got Pink Honeys. If you want large quantities of them, you could do it like we have in here. The ones that are easy to find and catch, like the Rads, if you go to the right place. The Crystals, when you get to the Indigo Quarry. And the phosphorus slimes, these are the easiest one to get a lot of money with at the beginning. Okay, because they eat fruit. So pogo fruit works great. Um, and you can get about 60, I think there's 70 in here right now. So if I just unload 200 fruit into here, if I fill my whole bar up with fruit, unload it in there, you suck up floors and spit it out. And if it's Q-berries, you get twice as much because that's their favorite food. Um, help Ogden. Okay, this is, uh, these guys are from Ogden. <laughs> Look at them, they're all happy and in sync. Um, Ogden Ortiz gives you his ranch, which is awesome. He also gives you huge beneficial upgrades. And you will meet Ogden uh, through the job thing over here. The job thing is greatly revamped if you didn't play it before. Woo woo for half a loop, it only showed up one thing. Did trees grow in there? Grow in where, C4? Oh, you mean when the guys were eating? No, these like vines like came up out of the ground, grabbed the chickens and ate them, I think. All right, so we are here. Okay, let's go put our plort in the one statue we know exists. Maybe since it's the beginning, that's all we'll need. One could hope. Yeah, that definitely did not do the trick. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Oh, he's up there. He's up there. I have to figure out how to get up to him. And we have to find the others. There were three um, rock slime ones. So I'm under the assumption that there will be three... Tangle slime locations to feed as well. Uh, that we have to put a port in. Yeah, kind of like Bulbasaur. <laughs> hmm. Oh, I found one. Was there one up there when we came in? I don't remember. Let's go up and find out. Nothing there. Nothing there. And they're not in here. 
This is so cool. Guy, developers, good job. And I'm sorry I haven't been keeping up with the game as much as I used to. Because holy cow, this is amazing. No, don't fall off. Falling off is bad. Alright, so wherever that Largo is, I'm not going to be able to fly there from here. There's a door or something up there. I wonder if I can get up there from here. Alley -oop. We have two, and like I said, I'm presuming there are three, because there were three of the other ones. <clears throat> oh, there it is. It sounds like it's on the back side of the wall. So do I have to fly up? Probably just around the other side. There's a, there's a door. Woods bread. Hello. How are you doing? You love this game. Awesome. It is. It's in there. And there's a door over here. Uh oh. Get inside. Get inside. Solar flare is imminent. There's the, the, the Gordo. I don't remember what he eats. Veggies, I think. We'll have to get some veggies from home. I have carrots and everything else. Um, I don't know if it grows more food when you're... Um, doing the thing. What's the thing I'm trying to think of, guys? Oh, when you have them expanded... So it does give you time. Oh, crap. And they go right through this building I'm in. That's not encouraging. Alright, screw it. We're going. Ten seconds left. I need another one. Give me another one. Oh. Not good there. Not good there. And I'm out of energy. And two and one. Fire slimes. Hopefully they'll stay. They'll be okay as long as I don't put them down. Okay, so you know it'd be lovely. It'd be lovely if I could get ancient water from not the hell way up there. Because that took a lot to get there. Oh yeah, those are the uh, explodey fire things. Alright, yes you, thank you. And Chaos Wolf was nice enough to explain to us that we have to take the fire slimes and put them in a uh, build incinerator and put them there and they will survive. Alright, up we go. Okay, and can we just hop around the ledge? I don't really think it's safe, is it? Oh, I'm out of energy. I gotta wait. Arrgh! Okay, come on. Alright, we're full.
Are there only these two? Is that all that's here? There were like a lot in the other section, so I'm wondering, I thought there would be several here as well. Alright, let me just double check there isn't one over in this area that we couldn't get because of the distance from the other one. Haha, uh -huh, I stole you. No, there's not. Alright, so I guess the next thing to do... Is to, uh... Feed the Gordo. And, thankfully, these places are growing fruit. So we're gonna go to each location and see if we can find... Some... Some pogo fruits or something that we can give to the dervish gordo back there that we have to climb up real high to go get. Um, because I'm I know the dervish ones eat fruit. But in most cases with the gordos, you need like 50. There's another prismatic. I actually want to take the prismatics home with me. But he just ate something he shouldn't have, huh? Nope, it was the other guy. That one ate something he shouldn't have. No, stop it. Alright, so this one's a lot of vegetables. There's a lot of carrots and a little bit of uh, the pogo. Let's, uh, there's one inside. Let's go look inside. Actually, there's one up here on the hill, too. Okay, that's vegetables. The heartbeats. Oh! I love it! Look at those pink Largos! Pink Largo Tangles are adorable! Oh, and they eat vegetables. Oh, no, they're pink, so they eat everything. Okay. They're, I should have realized that immediately, but I didn't. I also don't think I went to the very top of this one. I'm interested to see uh, what, if anything, is up there. Okay, carrots... I don't think anything food-wise is actually growing down here. Nope. We got some ancient water for the next 30 seconds. Then it becomes new water. Alright, well, I guess we will go work on that Gordo. We did find two Gordos now in this area. Where? Oh, we didn't feed him, so he didn't show up. Crap. I don't remember where the other one is, either. That's okay. We'll go work on this one. Is that fruit up there? No, that's one of those roosters. Took fruit, took fruit. Took that fruit. Uh, that's a wall. There we go. Loots. Ah, my ankle needs cracks up here, guys. I'm also double checking to make sure there aren't any more. I really thought there would be more um, of the ancient flowers to water. Is this one not producing any food? It isn't. Maybe it's a, an age thing. They produce more as they get older? Alright, nothing up here. I was hoping. Oh, down there. Alright, so we have about 30. That's, that's not going to fill them up. But, it's a start. We really need to jump up on this side. Is there a shortcut here somewhere? That I can climb to get up there. Oh, and I didn't look. Oh no, that's it was just a wall. Okay. All right. 
fly. It's not going to be high enough. Not even close. Darn. Oh, can I I can stand on a tree. I got lucky. I can stand on a tree. And I don't really need ancient water. You eat veggies? No, you eat fruit. You just have to shove it in their face. Don't hit me. I don't want to die in one shot. That would suck. There's a gap behind him. But it doesn't seem to have any real benefit. Ow. The good news is it only hit me for uh, a lot of health. <laughs> ten. It only hit me for ten health. Yeah, I didn't actually want to collect the dervish. See if we can find some more fire slimes. Got some more fruit growing. It's not quite ready. Alright, so we're going to cheat. We're going to go home and we're going to see if we can find... Uh, well, we're going to bring back some of the stuff we need. I can't think. Fruit. Uh, and probably vegetables. We're going to drop off these other mosaic slimes we got. We're going to sell the tangle plorts. We're going to build an incinerator and dock the fire slimes in there. Oh, this is where the other gordo was. What do you eat? You eat meat. I need to get you meat. I need a chicken. That's all I need one chicken and then it'll show up on the map because like he shows up on the map now because i fed him there's a chicken so bye bye pogo fruit hello rustro hello mosaic slime as well okay so i'm gonna feed her and then i I'll, i won't forget that she's up there i don't know why it's a she deal with it there we go now it's mark two Where'd he go? Did he try to eat a mo- oh, What is this? Prickle pear! Inventory report. Pineapple this inventory is a fruit confirmed. that knows how to fight back. That's funny. Okay, we're also gonna go plant some prickle pear. Woo woo for the loot! Ah! Or is that the other half of the last one, C4? It's getting messed up now. It's it's not acting right. Okay, so I want to, uh, I want to sell my tangle plorts, which I'm sure are worth tons and tons because they're more rare. A hundred and ten. We're gonna get some fruit for the uh the big guy. Why is there a pogo on my cuberry uh, tree? I do not know. It was a while ago. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I mean, I'm glad I didn't miss it again. Because that was bugging me. Those guys eat vegetables. Those guys eat the fruit. Those guys eat meat. There's nothing here. Okay, so we're going to actually demolish this. We're going to buy an incinerator. Can we an ash trough? We're definitely going to need that. Okay, so getting the ash trough means what? The slimes will stay in it. Kind of like puddle plorts. Is 
they fell out. And they set everything on fire. Come back, please. Oh, they're such a pain. Just like the puddle slimes, guys. Just like the puddle slimes. What the heck? Okay, I have to check Discord real quick. Is someone in Discord with me? No. Okay, guys, do you hear that then? The, like, fire alarms and stuff. Oh, no, did somebody hit the medic button? Did, I actually got that one working. But I was trying to amplify the sound, the audio, and I couldn't hear it. Uh, it wouldn't take. Prickle pear! Of course, we want to make it an awesome garden. Sweetness. Ah. Lewis Jedi Green, I'm going to go and use your tips on Slime Rancher. Absolutely, Lewis. There's a medic button. You press it. Okay. You can always uh, watch the uh, old streams. I've been streaming this quite a bit this week. So, by all means, you can watch and what you do like, use what you don't like, don't use. Alrighty then. So, I also developed a new personal goal. And that personal goal is to... Make friends with Mochi Miles. I was being incredibly judgmental because she's a stuck-up, pretentious snob. Owie, stop that. Um, however... Um, pretentious isn't the right word. She has a sense of entitlement she doesn't deserve. Um, or she has a sense of entitlement for reasons that... She doesn't deserve. Anyway. <laughs> uh, and it bothers me. So, I've been helping everyone but her. Intentionally ignoring her but not gonna do that anymore instead i'm gonna try and help her and see if i can turn her into a good person in the meantime we need to fill a big pot slime gordo up 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 a little faster if you please Wait for this to refresh so I can jump over. It's a bit of a chore to get up here. Better be worth it. Better be at least a key. The other guy, he's going to be significantly more difficult. This guy, he's going to pop in a minute. You know what? I'll take him. Whoa, 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 whoa. All you dervishes, come back here. Okay, I won't take them. They left. Money's always great. That looks like a rare diamond. An unusual diamond. Oh, you little prick. Give me my stuff back. They steal the stuff in their little tornado deal. Where's my unusual diamond? Oh, there it is. Primordial oil I'm not that worried about. Here, you guys probably just want food, huh? Give you a big old pile of it. And then we need to start collecting crazy chicken. It had me guessing, too. <laughs> I hadn't noticed it. Okay, so we're going to go around looking for chickens that we can take over to the other slime. Any chicken will do. Any one that no one's eaten, anyway. Oh, and here comes the storm. And I think I got enough fire slimes that I don't care. 
So we're just gonna keep going. We're gonna look for chickens and head back. We'll probably take teleporter and just go get a whole bunch of our chickens, bring them back. It's easy in the overgrowth area. Plus we have, I think, two active chicken coops. And I haven't used the one down by the docks in a long time. Tar slime. Okay, I don't know what it is about tar slimes, but they just explode here. Like, and that wasn't actually me doing... Well, that one was, but... The last few we've seen, I, I didn't actually hit with anything. Here comes the sun. Here comes the sun. Do-be-do-do. Here comes the sun. And I say... It's all right. That's in the B movie movie. I like the B movie. Show yourself, Hen Hen. Come here, Hen Hen. Nope, don't need any of that. I saw you, chicken. Get in my... Well, my vacuum gun, actually. Oh, are you gonna infinite do them? That'd be great! No. It did it because I walked over here, apparently. Oh, I saw you guys. I saw you guys. So it seems like when I suck up too many of the chickens, one of the nests instantly produces three more. The trick is finding it. On the other hand, sometimes you could just see them pop out of the ground, which makes it a little bit easier. I see chickens here. No. There's one. There's another. Get in! If we can get 50, it's like a guaranteed unlock. So. Sometimes it takes more than 50, but not normally, I don't think. I see you hiding there. Confusing onions with chickens, guys. My brain is going. You hide in here? Nope, okay. Let's go down here and say Danish Joan. Wow, what? I haven't heard that song in a Oh, yeah. Hey, you brought it up, okay? You got it in my head, and now it's there. Look at the chickens! This is enough chickens. This is definitely enough chickens. Whoa, don't be, don't be bouncing out. Alright, we'll leave those ones to refill. Hello, Super Gaming Girl! How are you? Alright, I wanted to deposit the diamond just because I don't need it. Then we're going to head back out to the glass desert. That's it. Glass desert. Maybe even wait for morning. Bloop. Oh, we got mail. From Africa? Oh, from Casey. About a reply to Africa. Thanks, Bay. <clears throat> B. Uh, I never knew you felt that way. I picture you out there on the safari avoiding the clutches of lions in the savanna, riding elephants across raging rivers, and then, as you sit under the stars at night, your weathered hand opens up a locket and there's a picture of me inside. And then your loyal chimpanzee companion gives you a somber knowing look. Is that accurate? <laughs> well, for what it's worth, I missed you too when I was in LA. Ugh, the bar was just awful. 
but at least I got some stage time. Casey. P.S. The chimp's name was Colonel Bananas. I'm fine. How are you? I am doing great. I am from the United States. What country are you from? Now I got that song stuck in my head. Guys, our quantum slimes are running amok. Look at them. They're just... We built them a pen. And there's a whole bunch of them in here. And I swear half of them aren't real. <sighs> and you cannot contain them. So, recommendation on those. Put them somewhere else. Somewhere by themselves. Okay, now we're going to go pop another Gordo. We popped one and we got a key, so we could go open a door, but I want to pop the second one. I want to see, I'm hoping there is a teleportal that leads to my, I forgot I built one. I'm hoping there's a teleportal that leads to my uh, location here uh, that's in my cave system. Oh, Louis Armstrong from the UK. Cool. Isn't it like super freaking late for you? Or is it like super, super early? I don't remember. You thought you could resist, but you can't. Yeah, there they are. We are taking all of them because they are so freaking adorable. Okay, it only brings me home. Well, that doesn't work. <sighs> okay, so that's the one that brings me home. Maybe I should try putting all the teleportals near there. In here, we... Oh, my. Everything's on fire. Why is the world on fire? Why would the mosaics be setting the world on fire? These guys are on fire. Sure. But come on. Okay, I have their plorts. It might be easier to contain them. Oh, here we go. Nope, just a little slower. Come here, you, and you are not where I would like you to be. Okay, so fire them at the wall so they bounce in and down. Noted. What do you guys eat again? Uh, 4.28 p.m. Wow, okay, so it's 11.30 my time. I'm about to stop for the morning. And then I'll be back in an hour and a half at 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. my time. So, yeah, that's UTC minus 5. Okay, that's what time zone I'm in. Nowadays, it's very hot. It is not getting hot enough fast enough here. Here's our man-eating plant ports known as Tangle Slimes. They like... Look at that. See, they... They like eat them and then these vines pop out that have the chicken on them and the chicken eat, gets eaten by the vine. It's crazy. That's crazy. Alright, so we're going to go sell some fire and tangle plorts just to get a feel for their value because the last time we sold some tangle plorts, they were worth over a hundred coins a piece. That's crazy. Okay, now they're only worth 75. And the fire is worth 68. So instead of selling them, uh, we're going to put them in the refinery. So that we can use them to build stuff later. Uh, that's the cell link. We're going to have to put a, um, a refinery link and a market link at, at Ogden's Ranch. Alright guys, so that is all for Slime Rancher today. Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, we are going to be back this afternoon, like I said. We'll be back in a couple hours. 1 p.m. The 4 p.m. Eastern time, that's UTC minus 5 for you guys who aren't familiar with stupid uh, time zones that don't have simple numbers uh, that you can easily math. <laughs> uh, but we will be back in a, an hour and a half, two hours, to play some Xbox Terra. Any of you guys want to play with me, you're more than welcome. 
I have a Reaper I'm going to show off for a little bit at first, and then we're going to discuss how we're going to meet up with C4 to help him get, for lack of a better phrase, caught up to where we are. But C4 was ahead of me with our other character. When I hit level 40, I made a new character. So we'll see. What recorder do you use? Super Gaming Girl? I use OBS. That's the streaming software I use. Um, and then I use Restream so that I can stream to YouTube, Mixer, and Twitch all at the same time. And see your chats. When the chat item wants to work. So there's our schedule. Uh, tomorrow, I don't know what the schedule looks like exactly. We're not starting until 9 a.m. Okay? 9 a.m. Um, for the Saturday streams. But I don't know if I'm just going to go three hours, take a break, go three more hours. We will see what happens tomorrow. All right, so I will... Well, Super Gaming Girl, hopefully you'll be available because it'll be a little bit later in your evening when I start my afternoon stream. It might even be easier for you to grab on a regular basis. So I will see you guys later. Remember that... Oh, hold on, let me, let me get onto the right screen. I need to fix this. And now my face is gone again. There we go. Come on. All right. That you're only playing the game wrong if you're not having fun. And I will see you guys back here a couple hours after I get some lunch. Have a great day, guys.